Hello friends, today I'm going to show you how we can configure IPsec remote access mobile tunnel by using open source PFSense firewall community edition. So in this IPsec we will use IKE version 2 and authentication method would be EAP MS Job V2. EAP MS Job V2 which is all, always work with the IKE v2 so first step is the creator certificate authority okay so let's go to pfsense this is my pfsense dashboard as you can see there is host name with the domain name the my pfsense is actually hosting on cloud and the cloud is on microsoft azure i will show you General setup host name my wall domain name pablo.me. So I am accessing this PFSense with my domain name pablo.me. Okay, so let's start. First, uh, I'll show you one more thing my WAN IP and my LAN. LAN is actually disabled, so WAN is behind not. Okay, so first we will create first step is our certificate authority so we will create that one go to ca right name ca you can keep any name and uh, method internal certificate authority and rest of the settings leave it as it is I will change this name common name with my domain name you can keep any name any desired name or save so our certificate authority is successfully configured now come to certificate which is our second step create a server certificate go to add select method internal certificate name ipsec server certificate authority select that previously we created and leave it all the setting as it is except common name here i will use my domain name if there is no domain name you can use your WAN IP okay now let's go to certificate type server certificate alternative names put one more time domain name again I'm telling you here you can keep domain name or your WAN IP address which is public IP address okay if there is no domain name use public ip address here but you have to add this alternative names for the sand okay i will cover this one in next video and add one more your ip address your man address of the pf sense it's my man address is 0.1.6 which is i will show you my van address this is behind not so that's why okay then save so both certificates are ready now next step is set up mobile ipsec ikev2 now go to vpn ipsec and go to mobile client enable user authentication local database select and give virtual ip address to the client i will use 10.10.0.0 with 24 bit and check this one network list for your network access lists and give dom dns name 
I will use Google DNS and one more for alternate. And leave as it is. If there is a required banner, you can select this one. Save. Apply. Now create phase one. Key exchange version. Now, as you know, we will go to the this is the phase one. Yeah, V2. V2 internal protocol IPv4 when description remote test server authentication method we will use EAP. EAP MS Java V2 my identifier so my identifier this is name i used uh, in my certificate pablo.me so same thing i have to use here keep this in mind you have to use same common name in this my identifier name if there is IP, use IP address. Now peer identifier, peer identifier is any, any. This is mobile client, so all WAN sources should be acceptable. That's why my certificate IP6 server and algorithm. I will go with uh, 3D ES and has SHA1 you can select your policy as per your requirement and I will use DH group 2 lifetime seconds 28800 and uh, not keep it auto that peer detection yes enable and save apply Go to phase two, add phase two mode before. I will go with my WAN subnet, my LAN is disabled. Description, put it description, protocol, ESP, disable AES, AES, and select 3D ES and SHA1, disable and Select group 2, lifetime 3600, save, apply. Now go to create shared key, as per, as per, I think so, yes. Create, create shared key. Add an identifier, you can keep your email, uh, there is my email. Select secret type EAP, pre shared key, use and <coughs> sorry, <coughs> yes, sense one, two, three, four, save. Now, what is the next step? Firewall rule. Go to firewall rules, select IPsec. It's already defined by the IP set out and under my van I for the time being I just put it all traffic up any source from any source and to any port so you can go through your security point of view you if you can open specific port for example ISKMP or uh, IPsec not these two ports you have to enable in your security okay so in my case I will go with the all for the testing and uh, let's see the now 
for the time testing we will transfer the certificate to my this windows client we have to transfer certificate authority export ca install local machine next yes and select the trusted root okay next finish successful finish now go to your windows and go to your adapter settings and go to networks sharing center set up a new connection select workplace use my internet and use here your domain name in my case i'm using pablo.me this is my domain name of the pfns and which is configured in certificates plus ip phase one setting if you use ip address you can you can you put it here ip address destination name vpn connection vpn uh, ip set and create go to back adapter settings properties security type of vpn is our ike version 2 encryption yes require encryption authentication yes we have selected eap ms v2 encryption enable okay ah sorry uh, go to networking and use ipv4 only disable ipv6 why because we in our virtual network we have created ipv4 only okay refresh and ping 110.10.0.1 let's see now we'll try to connect yes it's asking username and password the same please share the key we have created with the email password was pfsense123 4 yes it's connected there is a reply 10.10.01 which is our virtual network let's go to pfsense status ipsec there is the remote id is my email and my local ip of the windows and the remote local ip of van and it's v2 responder okay let's i will try with my pfsense so van ip 0.1.6 Yes, it's opening. Continue. Okay, so now we are coming through this one. I will show you my Azure Wi-Fi firewall networking. I selected my source only this my WAN IP. The rest I open these ports, but no need because the first priority I give this rule to at zero, which is actually I allow my traffic. To only this IP as for the security you can I think internet is down yes okay but uh, we have to allow this one go to your VPN IPsec and phase 2 go to networks select network select all the networks 0.0.0 .0 select 0 here so it will allow all traffic except internet traffic okay. so VPN is still connected now internet should be there let's try VPN stop 
we will reconnect this connector so internet also is there now it switched to my azure ip you can see which is indian ip indian wan ip indian indian john now i'll show you <coughs> sorry i'll refresh this page and this is my rule source ip only this one any port any destination but this is my case you case you can open specific port uh, to the specific source uh, i just open all any port any source for the testing purpose only i hope this video will helpful for you and uh, i hope you will like subscribe and keep forward keep liking thank you